April Fool's Day yesterday. Did you? Did you? Did you? <laughs> so many funny joke stories in the papers. Uh, Waitrose advertised a brand new fruit, the Pinana. There it is. Now, <laughs> excuse me, that looks delicious. I have been using it. Uh, the Daily Mail had a tartan sheep. They did. <laughs> and, uh, seriously, and the Guardian claimed that America had a black president. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite. I'm sure it's yours too. The best, best political story this week was the Home Secretary's husband. Oh, <laughs> put in an expenses claim for two adult films he'd watched on cable. <laughs> now, oh, there is the lovely couple. Oh. <laughs> now, why do they need porn to spice things up? <laughs> oh, they're like animals. Now, uh, Jackie Smith said she didn't know anything about it. And see, that's the problem with this relationship. The left hand doesn't know what the right hand is doing. <laughs> <laughs> when the story broke, poor Jackie was in tears. Unfortunately, she couldn't find the box of tissues. No, it was anyway. <laughs> hey, I'm very excited about tonight's show. Who shall I tell you about? Well, my first guest is the lovely and extremely glamorous actress, Patsy Kenzen is here. <laughs> yes, she is. Of course, at the moment, you'll all know her from Holby City, but she's been in lots of great films. Uh, here she is in uh, Lethal Weapon 2. Whoa ho! <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm guessing the Home Secretary's husband claimed for that a couple of times. <laughs> and I seem to remember that she had sex with Mel Gibson and then drowns afterwards, which is one hell of a wet patch, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Not all of Patsy's films have been hugely successful, although one of her films uh, did spawn a number of sequels. Her wedding video. Uh, oh, she's here! Uh, no, it's true, Patsy has been married to a few people, uh, mainly musicians. Uh, she's married to uh, Jim Kerr from Simple Minds. There he is. Uh, Liam Gallagher. More Simple Minds. <laughs> also on the show, European acting royalty and Oscar-winning star of Life is Beautiful, Roberto Benigni is here. Yes, he is. I know. Very, very posh. Uh, Roberto genuinely is my, my favourite Italian actor. Well, after Sophia Loren and uh, uh, Pinocchio. I don't know. <laughs> He's in the top five. Uh, Roberto was here to discuss his new theatre show, uh, which is all about Dante's Divine Comedy. Now, what can I tell you about the Divine Comedy that you don't already know? Well, we only have half an hour. Let's go with it. It's a book. Uh, <laughs> no, the, the, the Divine Comedy is all about a journey through hell. Now, in the book, the entrance to hell is guarded by Cerberus, the three-headed dog. Here he is. Oh, look at him there. Three heads. I tell you, that dog must have the cleanest bollocks ever. <laughs> <laughs> They'd be fighting over them, wouldn't they? <laughs> Let me have a go. <laughs> That, of course, is a three-headed dog, not to be confused with the two-headed dog. <laughs> <laughs> well, now you like them? Where were you when they needed you? Uh, Dante's book comes with lots of illustrations. Uh, here is one of the circles of hell. Uh, here's the river Styx. And here is the entrance to purgatory. Uh, <laughs> Forward to your letters, all jumbled up. It's funny. <laughs> Let's get some guests on. Live production of Gamma, quick notes on the screen. It's gorgeous, Patsy Kendrick. Whoa! Whoa! Look at that! Oh, look at that. Oh, the marble wall. Oh, 
There you go. Mm -hmm. oh. Thank you. Oh. Uh, welcome to the show, both of Thank you. you. Thank you. Oh, we were there. I think it's fair to say Roberta's excitable. <laughs> <laughs> and, no, but, but, but famously uh, excitable because, of course, Life is Beautiful. Uh, we'll talk about uh, the Dante show in a bit, but Life is Beautiful, an amazing film, won the Thank Oscar you. for Best Foreign Film, and then you won Best Actor at the Oscars. Yeah. Because you did go... Mental, really, didn't you? you <laughs> he, do you remember he ran on the backs of the chairs? Right, because I wasn't expecting you, so I couldn't contain the energy. What the hell my name? I couldn't believe I wasn't prepared, so I was too chul ta 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 that you ever to demonstrate no the gratitude because you did afterwards did the did the the organizers were they happy with you or did they shout at you <laughs> for no they uh, what, what, uh, did they, were they yeah. across were they aggressive or now <laughs> i could do that she's, 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 she's much more comprehensive than you are she's, she's very comprehensive multi-aggressive or uh, yeah. At tre poco. No, no, no. But, uh, <laughs> no they were, uh, so be careful to the furniture, they told me. Yeah, yes. I've been told, yeah. And it was Sophia Loren who gave Sophia you. Sophia Loren, oh. she gave me, yeah. Because she's, there she's trying to calm me In down. Italy, no. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Oh. They made a rap about this. Roberto, hey, tum, ta, ta, tum, ta, Roberto, tum, ta, ta, tum, ta, <laughs> Really? Yeah, there is a rap in Italy. Yes, so I didn't know. <laughs> and listen, but the film was just so successful. Uh, like the the Pope, you you had to go to a special screening no, with the who Pope. Who told you about the Pope? But this is like a secret thing, you know. <laughs> you, no, really? I, I, I really. It, this is a very straight part. May I tell you the story? Please. It's very yes. short. Very Please. short. Yeah. But it was unbelievable because I went in Los Angeles for publicity for the film. No, I, I landed in Los Angeles. They called me in the hotel. The Pope want to see you. No, I, I just, I stayed. <laughs> <laughs> I came back, I flew back, yeah. I flew back, and, and I've been told, the Pope want to see the movie with you. You know, he, he dedicated maybe one hour for Clinton, for the president, for me, an entire day. <laughs> unbelievable, I'm, I, I, really, I, I, incredible. incredible. So, incredible. I, I came back, <laughs> and they organized in Vatican, in a church, in a church, a real church, the screen, and we were sitting there with uh, uh, 20 nuns. <laughs> This is the truth. I, I swear, I swear. I, I just, uh, 20 nuns, but very beautiful, elegant. Really very, I am very serious, very serious. Eh? Elegant, and me and the Pope, like Patsy, she is the Pope now, like this. Sitting like this, watching the movie. With and popcorn? Me. Eating popcorn? Uh, no popcorn. Po no, no, the no. popcorn. Yes, popcorn. 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 <laughs> popcorn. <laughs> <laughs> You can even have a big bishop's hat. <laughs> but no, that's what, that incredible. No, no, the, and, and what, uh, you know, my heart uh, was really beating, uh, beating uh, b b uh, bounces. Yes. Rebounded, rebounded. Tum, 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 tum. <laughs> because I was doing like this, it was the real pop. Yeah. There, the real pop with me. What? You know, for, for me, the pop is really, is really someone, uh, 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 Graham, it's something really, you yeah, cannot... That's, yeah, that's the pop. You understand? Yes, it's, the, it's, it's the pop. It's the pop in person. And uh, I, I, I jump on him for the joy. <laughs> I swear. I jump on him. No, when I met him, I jump on him for the joy. For <laughs> the joy to... I kissed him in everywhere. <laughs> and, and he told me, he, he wrote me a letter. He said to me that, uh, that I was for him like a son. He felt, uh, 
something like a little boy, like Pinocchio, when a uh, with Geppetto, yeah, oh, Papa, Bambo, Bambo! Oh, the best <laughs> man in the world. I had an audience with the Pope of film that I did initially, Don Bosco. I met him too. Don Bosco with Ben Gazzara, and he wanted to see it, and it was, he... You see? See? It's... The Pope won't... Anyone else met Both. the Pope? <laughs> Special pope, special, special pope, pope. unbelievable. But, but, Have but, you I, met the Pope? No. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I've only made one film, but I don't think the Pope wants to watch it. <laughs> <laughs> the, um, but the weird thing is, the weird thing is, though, yeah. oh, you've met everyone. Yes. No, you really have, because... No, I, I have. I, I, I know I, that you've slept with everyone. So I no, you have met. <laughs> She's at Don Bosco, you're right. At Don Bosco, right. yeah, yeah, you know, Bosco, I've had a great life. It's been a great journey. And I'm writing a book now, which is like, you know, just about the whole, you know, everything. You know, um, really, I, I feel like it's, you know, there's a lot of story to From the craze, you know, my dad. Oh, yeah, because you did Who Do You Think You Are? That's right, yes. Now, so, did, did you see the facts, Who Do You Think You Are? Because <laughs> basically, it's just crims up the wazoo, isn't it? It's just... Yeah. It, yeah. Which, it, it, that sort of upset you. You've got... Well, you know, the thing is, I mean, oh, God, I'm, you're not bored, are you? Are you OK? Yes, <laughs> My dad was, uh, you know, my dad was in and out of prison my whole life, and, and you know, wrong or right, he was my father, and I, and I love him to bits. But we were kept the, protected by it. I mean, the police would turn up at the house all the time and turn the house over, and um, I, because I was working, I paid for my own education. So I went to the convent, and my brother went to the local comprehensive. So I used to get beaten up on a regular basis walking back home, you know, because I had to wear my convent uniform and all the kids on the estate, you know, kick the shit out of me. Yeah. But, you know, it's fine, it toughened me up. Um, and then I'd go off and I'd make these movies and do all of that, but my, I didn't, I knew my dad, obviously, you know, when he went to prison for six, six and a half years, I realised that, you know, it was, we said he was an antiques dealer and that kind of, you know, it was... <laughs> um, but he was a criminal. All of this I didn't really know about, and so when I found out that my dad's father, who I'd never known, had been in prison for the first ten years of his life. I then thought, oh, why am I doing this show? It's going to go back... I mean, I'm going to be related to Jack the Ripper. I mean, that's it, you know? I'm screwed. I'm absolutely screwed. It's, it, it's, it's all over, you know? But it was horrible. I mean, I cried for Great Britain. I got, it, I, it made me ill doing it, actually. I mean, it, I Isn't was... that weird? It, uh, well, Maybe you thought ill, but I was a bit bored when I was doing it. Were you? Yeah. Yeah, but you, find, you just found out you were Irish. Were you I know. That? I kind of knew that. Yeah. <laughs> I just ate. What I did was eat. I just ate chips and donuts and pie and mash. I was like, I just got. <laughs> I was just so. It was emotionally tra traumatic. Have you ever followed your family back? Do you know your family roots? Oh yes, I do a lot. Yes. yes. All my family. Yes. Yes. So where I am you from? Tuscany. Yeah, Italy. Yeah. Yeah. It's, you're Italian. <laughs> I am Italian. Like, like I'm Irish. Yes, yeah. you're Irish. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. I love Italy. Don't you love Italy? Do you know, I have hardly been to Italy. Oh, I love Italy. Because France is first, I sort of just stop there. <laughs> they have wine. Why bother going that's, any further? That's such a poor excuse. I know, it is rubbish. But we're going to go and be in one of Roberto's movies. He said oh, yes, that. of course. Yes, that's yes. right. Yes, yeah, we'll yeah. work for food. Good yeah, Italian um, food. Yeah, we'll, we'll meet the Pope. Yes. Um, <laughs> but listen, I talk about weddings because you are getting married soon in real life. <gasps> Again? Yes. Yes. No, I know. I joke about it. And I shouldn't. I mean, it's, you know, divorce is really, really terrible and sad. And, but I had. This I, is your fourth time. <laughs> 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 I mean, because your friends must be a bit like, oh, for God's sake, what do we buy her now? <laughs> like, your wedding list must be so obscure. Things like a tarantula. <laughs> Do you have a wedding list this time? I like weddings. <laughs> clearly. <laughs> clearly, you yeah. love them. <laughs> Are you doing... And is it going to be, like, a proper wedding? We're having a big wedding. I've never, I've never had a big wedding. We've always gone off and done it really quietly, cos nobody approved about it, you know, <laughs> uh, on, on, on every side. And that's not true. I mean, I had some really wicked times with, with, with my p partners and some very rock-and-roll times and... And some... have, have friends of yours been to all your weddings? 
Uh, not everyone's been to them all, but... My, you have. I've been there all... I, yeah, I was kind of present at the last one. Um, um, but no, my, my eldest stepdaughter um, was, at, was obviously at, at, when I got married to Jim, and, she, and, and uh, you know, and, and I think Jim's, Jim's going to... might come. He might not. I think, he's, I think he's sick of seeing me get married, actually. But, um, no, it, you know, it's going to be great, and my boys are giving me away, um, and... Um, and, and it's, I, you know, I'm, I'm really happy and I feel very lucky to have found Jeremy and, and, and I, you know, I, I love him and it's going to be great and I'm very, I feel very, very blessed.